Hey crypto bros and sisters, it's your boy Jojo. Welcome back to the channel as always. If you're new to the channel, I hope you gain some value from the content. All right guys, let's jump right into the crypto news. A group of disgruntled cryptocurrency investors have launched a class action against Atomic Wallet guys, which suffered a major breach and $100 million in losses in June. I'm actually surprised it took this long for users to sue, to be honest. Dozens of wealthy investors from Russia and the Commonwealth are part of this class action lawsuit against Atomic Wallet. The lawsuit is being coordinated by German lawyer Max Gutbrod and Boris Feldman, a co-founder of Moscow Legal Tech from Destra Legal, guys. Mr. Gutbrod said his law firm is representing about 50 clients who lost a total of $12 million in the aftermath of Atomic Wallet breach two months ago. Here's a quote from him. We are working on recovering the assets for our clients and we will be filing a class action against Atomic Wallet. They didn't give our clients any information about the hack or go to the police to report it. Atomic's wallet non-custodial crypto wallet suffered a massive $100 million exploit in mid-June 2023. The breach affected at least 5,500 crypto wallets on their platform. The hack actually came from a hacker group from North Korea called Lazarius. I remember when I made a video about Atomic Wallet being hacked. I believe the company took a while to confirm that they were actually hacked and by then thousands of users wallets were already drained. These companies lack cybersecurity to protect customer funds guys. Atomic Wallet didn't even clarify what conditions exactly led to the exploit in June. The firm only laid out four most probable causes including a virus on the user device, an infrastructure breach, a middleman attack or malware code injection. Atomic Wallet also continued to tell people that only 0.1% of users were affected. We all know that's a damn lie. Atomic Wallet just continued business as usual, never informing users of updated security procedures or a plan to make users whole again. I wouldn't use that wallet ever again, guys. I hope they lose that lawsuit because Atomic Wallet needs to be held accountable. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to hit me up on TikTok at no cap crypto with two O's at the end. And if you gain any value here on YouTube, please help your crypto bro out by subscribing and liking the video. I'll talk to you guys later.